whole three guide for you guys and what, what, what I'm going to use for this is just a sniper and a kingmaker. Um, you know, the better wind resistance ball you put on, the easier it's going to be. Um, I really wanted to use a long iron here, but when I saw the wind, uh, it kind of, you know, deterred that plan. So what we're going to do is we're going to just play off of this bump right here, somewhere right around here. And what I'll usually do is kind of offset my guide a little bit, send it a little bit long of the hole, kind of like this, so you can see kind of where I'm set up to do. It's about 2.75 on the backspin as well. And you can see where I'm kind of setting up. And I expect, you know, I play one-to-one -one on the ring play. So in this case, you know, I'm going to go 7.4-ish rings. That's what you can see me going there. And, you know, with the offset of my guide, I'm just, you know, assuming that that wind eventually is going to take over and it's going to shoot it towards the hole. And here you can see it actually misses on the, uh, the right-hand side there. So you do need to just kind of play around with that landing zone a little bit. And, you know, hopefully you can, you know, get that initial startup point exactly where you want. So one thing that I'd adjust is I might come in just a little bit, one extra ring um, on my starting point before I actually start adjusting rings, before I go about playing that shot. And, uh, you know, I would expect with that kind of, uh, you know, just tweaking that initial landing zone is going to be the, the, the way to get dialed in there where you want it. And what you will be able to do is as soon as you get that land zone where you want, it's just going to feed right towards the hole um, each and every time. You're going to give yourself a very good chance going at it, um, and especially with you know a headwind, that's going to be you know extremely what I recommend doing uh, for for that hole is kind of mimicking my land zone. But you're just going to have to to tweak around with and, and just actually find. You know the perfect little groove there to get it to hop and and feed right towards the hole so good luck there and i'll catch you guys for hole six hole four coming up